want to get a head start on the competition in Madden 18? Well, this video is going to teach you exactly what you need to know to get a head start in your game for Madden 18. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. In today's video, one of the things that we're going to be looking at is something simple that I've been doing that you can do too that is going to help you prepare for Madden 18. So uh, every single year, normally there's a website or someone in the community that's going to release the playbooks for Madden 18. And you can go through and you can kind of look at what team has what and just kind of get an idea of, of what the game is going to look like. And so um, I actually left a link in the description for the site. It's called MaddenSchool.com. They have released all of the playbooks, and I've also been watching some of the Madden 18 videos uh, from people like S. Gibbs, Problem, Z. Farles. Those guys are trustworthy people in the community that you can watch who are going to give you an honest opinion about the game. So I was checking that out, looking at that, and kind of watching, and uh, one of the things I figured out was, well, the Shotgun Bunch, as I thought, uh, is still going to be one of the better plays in the, uh, still going to be one of the better plays in the game. So... Um, what I noticed is PA post is still in, stick is still in. If you go to uh, the thing that they did do, they did switch Z spot into something weird. Another thing that they did though, um, and I don't, I'm not in the right playbook, so I need to get out of this and go back out and, and show you. Um, but what you want to do is you. So I was in the Pittsburgh Steelers playbook. The Pittsburgh Steelers playbook has changed slightly, very very slightly, um, to to next season. And the play that's going to replace Z spot. Is um is not already in the Pittsburgh Steelers playbook, but in Madden 18, it is in the Pittsburgh Steelers playbook. So uh, all of that to say, you need to find the playbook in Madden 17 that you can use that has the same plays you want to work on. So again, I I just work on a couple of specific plays. So the Cincinnati Bengals playbook, I believe they have it. Let me see if I can find it. Yeah, they do. So the play that we're going to use to replace it is the bunch trail. That's the play we're going to use to uh, replace Z spot. I don't think the curl flat play with the very deep corner route is in the gun bunch tight end is not it's it's in hardly any playbooks. It's out of the Colts playbook. So what that means is essentially we're going to need to make some adjustments to if you were running the bunch tight end. Um, you know, you just got to find those playbooks. But what this can allow you to do, in my opinion, is it allows you to set yourself up for success because you go online, you look at all the playbooks, you figure out what are the plays. Um, dang it, I'm in a play now. I'm struggling today in the menu. Um, but what you need to do is you need to figure out what are the plays that I can have access to now that I can start working on and principles I can start applying. Because here's the thing, guys. Uh, Madden every year, even though it changes, like there's very subtle things that do change, it's majority, it's, it's mainly the same principles. Um, I was watching a video by Problem, and one of the things he was doing was he went back to his shotgun trips inside zone offense. That's what he's running. So, uh, you know, it, and that was what he ran, I think, two years ago. And he ran something similar to that in the Madden Challenge. But what I'm trying to get at, guys, is you want to go ahead and settle in on your plays. And you want to also uh, stay tuned to my channel. Stay tuned to, to Z Farles and S Gibbs and Problem. Because they're going to show you guys the mutt players that you need to get to, to be successful. So I'm going to have some videos talking about the mutt players, the budget players and that. Because they're already released on Mutthead. If you go to mutthead.com, you can find that. And then you can start studying, try to find your budget players. So then what happens is once that game comes out, you're spending very, very little time um, studying the game. And much more time, you know, just playing. OK, so so that's what I would recommend real quick before we go. I wanted to give you the setup that I'm going to use for bunch trail. So that you can have it. So um, so we have we're going to run PA post exactly the same uh, bunch trail. What we're going to do is we're going to run it exactly like Z spot. So we're going to put the tight end on an in route, far outside receiver on an out route and Ezekiel it on the um, on that route right there. Motion out. And it's exactly the same. Um, the post route is, in my opinion, it's, it's as good, uh, as the Z spot route. You know, the only thing that, that sucks about it is that you don't get a free release. Um, because in Madden 18, what I've been noticing is a lot of people are running more man coverage 
even though this still beats man, it takes a little longer to get there. So, but anyways, guys, wanted to share this with you. The biggest thing I could tell you, the biggest piece of advice I have for you after this video, the takeaway, the action item, what you need to do is you need to go in the description. You need to follow the link from MaddenSchool.com, and you need to figure out what playbook are you going to use in Madden 18, and then work backwards once you figured that out. So go to the description, figure that out. What playbook are you going to use? Once you have figured that out, work backwards, develop your system, and then put the plays in your Madden 18 or your Madden 17 scheme and start working on them in practice mode and, and play now and head to head and all that stuff. So anyways, guys, want to thank you for your time. Hope this video gave you some value. Again, I don't have any affiliation with the site below. I'm just, I just noticed that they had a free playbook. So I wanted to get that to you as quickly as possible. Thanks for watching guys. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. And if you have any questions about what we do here, uh, then leave me a comment and I'll get back to you. Thanks guys. And we'll see you in 